Good morning, Minecraft, and welcome back to the Wolf Den! Today I am back in my workshop, I guess is what I'm going to call this, and one of the viewers, uh, Sweet Rave Party, I believe was their name, asked me to try out a texture pack they put together. So in this episode, I'm going to record everything using their texture pack. And good luck to me learning what exactly is what. Um, I think I can figure figure it out. Um, cobblestone, pine, wood, wood planks. I need to pick up some more cobble because I'm going to be working on building another building today. Is that this? I have no idea. I'm guessing because most of this should have been pine up here. And I think I'm going to use up the rest of that and make it into planks because I'm going to need some planks as well. In my last episode I said I was going to record building the next building but I went ahead and accidentally did it without uh, without recording it so I apologize but I am going to record a building of a building or of a house that's a nice pumpkin I really like that kinda cool so well let me show off this second building first it's built a little differently the, the door is in the f on the side or on the short side and not the long side The other homes that I've built here, I put the, the door on the long side of the building. So to make the next one, where do I want to put it? Probably right here. So what I'm gonna new is I'm gonna need some dirt to help lay out the pattern. Um let's go three over from the first and we'll start a corner right there so what I want to do next is place or mark out the the foundation as well as where the windows are gonna go I'm gonna make this in a slightly different style than the two others that I made before I want to make this one with bay windows in it so for the bay windows, they need to be four wide. One, two, three, four. Because what they'll look like is they'll... Oops. I didn't want to do that. They'll, they'll come out like that and have that kind of a shape to them. So that's what the windows, or the base of the windows, are going to look like. So I need four wide. But do I want two windows on each side? So, okay, if I do that, I'm going to go one, two, three for a door. Actually, let's make it a double door. And this is going to be the porch, I guess, just like it is over there. And I'm going to put some stairs here. So we'll skip another block. Torches in the way. Two, three, four. Recover the torch. Place that for the window. And that is a corner piece. Now for the width, I believe I'm going to go with three wide windows. One, two, three. These are not going to be bay windows. They're just going to be normal. One, two, three. And like that. 
So I think that's going to be the right shape. There, and then one, two, three, four. Place a block and our corner piece. Now, should place these in correctly and everything should match up. And a torch in the way again. I just ran around earlier, just spammed out a whole bunch of torches because I kept getting attacked by spiders and creepers and all kinds of annoying things. I think what I'm just going to do is going to go up the next the next row. could probably go up to... Oops. I don't know what's with the double clicking here. Why am I not using a pickaxe? Haha. <laughs> okay. Put one there. And there'll be the double doors. Out of cobblestone. I'm probably gonna have to go back and get some more anyways. Cause this building is gonna take a lot of cobblestone. It's also gonna take up a lot of wood. Once I get to the second and third floor, it's gonna take up a lot of wood. And what I'm not putting in at the moment right now is the floors. I'm just gonna do the walls. And then I'll put in some ladders and take care of the walls later. Or I mean the floors. Take care of the, f the flooring in between. But, oops. Okay, well that's where the floor is supposed to go. And it's getting late, so probably going to finish off, well, I think I should just cut it and go to the, the bed and get some sleep. After taking a short break, I thought I, since I'm in a new texture pack, I would go check out the animals that I've got. looking sheep. <laughs> Pigs I like. And the wheat looks nice. Check out the chickens. Oh look, there's a couple of eggs. Chickens. Okay, now I'm gonna head back to work. Finish up that first floor of the house. So, I need to make another row actually looks like another two rows but since the next row is going to be a little bit different I'm just going to make the one row here and then I'll come around and make the second row oh I probably should have picked up some cobble as well oops this is all wrong I need wood block there and then a cobble on top of it. So I'm going to try and follow the pattern from that first building over there which is cobble on the first floor and a mix of cobble and wood on the upper floors and then a roof made out of cobblestone. So now I have to go back and get some more, which I think is over here in the second building. Because I dug out a basement in this building, there was a hole underneath... There was a hole underneath it. So I just turned that into a basement and lit it all up so that monsters wouldn't spawn down there or at least not spawn as much 
<laughs> they still spawn sometimes. So let's make a little staircase to get up to this floor. Or this layer, I should say. Not an entirely entire floor by itself. Now I'm going to place cobble over that. And that's going to look like it does over there. And then the interior will be filled with wooden planks for the, the flooring itself. Okay, so the second floor is going to start like that. And there's a block of wood. There should be two empty spaces. Or f not two, excuse me. There should be four empty spaces like this. And that's going to be the bay window like that. I'm not sure if that's going to work right. I'm going to put glass in it later once I've done mining out some sand. As you can see, all my all the houses do not have any windows. I have not collected any sand for those at all. And then a log there. Oops, that's not right. We want a wood piece here. We want to skip three. Put a wood there, skip three, another block of wood. And then here is another bay. Now there should be another one on this side as well. Oops, not wood. I'm really messing up today. Placing the wrong blocks. Oops, I need an axe. And I'll pick that up later. Nope, not dirt. Wood. And then I'm just going to put these here and then put the cobble down where it belongs. Apparently not where it belongs. <laughs> okay, so those are three, three bays on this side. And that's what that corner looks like. Yes, I hurt myself, I know. But I'm trying to do this quickly. Normally I would take a lot more time and not hurt myself <laughs> in order to do this. Ow. Because normally I have the floor put in, but I'm skipping over that step and just putting in the, the third floor instead. Oh, I can't reach. Why am I not reaching? Maybe because it's four wide, not three. That would be why. I should probably put the wood in. There we go. And then the cobble. Okay, and this would be the layer with the third floor on it. There would be a 
another wooden, wooden floor up here that covers the whole the whole area. I'll get to putting the flooring in in a little while, but right now I just want to get the windows set up. Oh, the framing. That's what it is, the frames. <laughs> Get the house framed in first. Okay, I'm back. I'm up on the beginning of the third floor and something I realized that I forgot to do on the third floor was set up the bay windows. Just kind of like I did on the second floor. One, two, three, four, and then one, two, just like that. Planks. Now this is the third floor. I'm going to try putting a bay in here and see how it looks. And if I really don't like it, I won't put it in any more houses. <laughs> because I'm once I've got these two designs... These are the two basic house designs, that one and this one over here that I'm going to populate through the whole town. So I'm still kind of figuring it out. Um, basing it off of another uh, Minecraft video from looks like a long time ago when the game may have still been in either alpha or creative or classic mode, I don't, I can't tell by by its age exactly what version it was, because I've only been playing since version 6, so. Okay, this is the beginning of the third floor. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill in the floor this time, and hopefully I have enough wood. If not, I can always turn some of the logs into wood. Like that. No, that's not right. I'm probably I'm not going to repeat this construction through each and every house unless I do come up with a, a third design or fourth design or there's uh there's some other buildings, municipal style buildings. Uh Things like, I want to build a library. Yes, again, another library. But uh, this one's going to be a little different. Oh, it needs to match the building style of the, of the town. So it's not going to be the giant, massive sandstone building that I've got. It's probably going to be uh, cobblestone and more... Um, kind of European look to it, like what I've got here. Whoa! I almost fell off. Okay, here I am, up on the roof, about ready to start the roof. So what I do is, here I'm going to place two blocks. and fill that in. I'm going to cut whatever pattern, maybe a circle or some shape, whatever pattern for the window later. Not going to do it right now. And then come over here to the other side. Oh, darn it. I messed up already. Well, I need to finish this side first. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a stair step up from there. So it's two up from the the top of the roof. And then make stairs up each side from there. And I'm hoping it ends in an odd number. Just because that's the way the other roofs have been so far. Um, mostly because cutting a pattern out of an odd number gives me a single piece in the center. Otherwise I'd have to have 
like for that that diamond shape I would have to have two wide at the top which doesn't make for a very good looking diamond unless you make it a lot bigger so yeah that came out that came out odd so we're good so the only reason why I would consider building with wool is if I was building something oriental um, because they have paper houses and to me it would seem okay to build a paper house out of wool it, it's not that big of a, a stretch for me I guess but other than that building out a wool just seems wrong I don't know am I crazy or something I guess but that's just how I think about it honestly um gonna have to remove these two blocks so I can get in here each one of my houses actually has an access on the roof but you really can't see it from the the ground or even on top of the, the viewpoint that I have up there. This is how I build a roof, I guess. Um, pretty, pretty basic, simple roof building. But with the only difference is that the, the side of the house is taller than the roof itself. Um, can't really say for sure where I saw this. Um, sometimes I do some research into buildings. I don't build, I mean, because it's Minecraft, it's really hard to build things exactly as, as you see them. But I try to come as close as I can. I don't know, maybe my Minecraft buildings are actually build better than the original. <laughs> of course! That blocky look, it's so much better! I don't know, it's just... Sometimes it's more fun to build in Minecraft. Yeah, I have been kind of enjoying the creative mode. Haven't really used it much before. Never used any of the the mods that allow you to like too many items. Never used any of those before, so or even the the flying um It's kind of interesting makes building a uh, building like this much easier I don't have to worry about this scaffolding I just need a uh, like a center point or something to build on so I'd build maybe a stack of gravel or sand or something I don't think torches belong on the roof um, everything up here is either half slabs or stairs, which monsters shouldn't be spawning on anyways. So I don't think there's any need for lighting up here. Um, that building over there doesn't have half slabs, like I'm putting them up here. I was thinking I probably should go back and do that. But for now, it's just rough, just basic wood. Unless those are wood half slabs, I can't tell from here. And then I gotta just go along and remove the scaffolding. Dirt makes a really good scaffolding. It's easy to remove when you're done, and it actually stays in the air. Um, sand and gravel are much easier to remove but they won't stay put if you put them up there.
so that's a rough outline for the house. Um, probably need to go back and finish up putting the floors in. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Which I don't know if I've got enough wood for. It usually takes about two stacks. Oh, that's not wood. That's okay, that's dirt. Okay, I've got three stacks, or almost three st stacks here, so that should be good to put in a floor up here. Okay, that's the third, f or the, no, this is the fourth floor with the attic up here. Um, and it looks like I've used almost exactly two stacks of planks to finish it. Now, I think I'm just going to cut a basic diamond out of this. And get shot by a... Uh... Hmm. I don't think it's fitting. But a basic triangle. I guess that works. That's what I'll do for now. I probably could have made it taller to get a nice diamond out of it, but I think this is going to work for now. Okay, that is a basic rough outline for the framework of the house. And uh, let's go take a look at how the town is coming from the, the viewpoint up there on top of that hill. Which I probably need to work on someday. Because I still have the basic rough cut stairs. I'd like to put in some wood and maybe a nice wooden platform up there that I can't get pushed off of. Okay, there's the town so far. Four buildings! Woohoo! We're coming along! <laughs> Only, what is this? Episode 8 or 9 or something? I don't know. I really haven't been counting the episodes yet. But that's how it's looking so far. Definitely want to uh, expand it some more. Um, I know I scouted quite a bit more to the south, but I'm thinking I may want to expand it to the east instead. Because I like that river. So, I don't know. Um, so, in the next episode, I believe what I'm going to do is go ahead and fill in the windows. So check back next time after I've been... I'm going to have to uh, do some sand gathering. There's a little bit of a desert over there, and I think there's another desert farther to the east. So I'm going to have to gather up some sand, and when I get back, I'll have some glass, and we'll fill in some windows. Maybe we'll see how the bay windows turn out in the new building. So, for now, this is One Wolf. You guys have been awesome. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.